What's going on, Clutch? What? what up, what up, what up? It's your boy, Dub. It's your boy, Ross. We're in the Clutch. Hey, hey back to ladies and gentlemen of the bitch today, you feel me? How uh, Goku became the Weave Nation president against <laughs> Kefla. This, this was a, a, a dope moment. Kefla, you know what I'm saying? Uh, she, she thought she had it, had it in the bag. My boy tapped into that ultra instinct and started having her missing everything. Goku was being Goku, huh? Yeah, everything. She was shook. She was like, wait a minute. How the, what is happening here? <laughs> so, I like how they got the LeBron and AD. Yeah, um, nah, bro. Yeah, because she, nah, it, hey, Goku was about to get packed up. But he said, nah. As usual. I'm the main character. <laughs> <laughs> so, Finally. Oh, so yeah, definitely, definitely a classic moment in Dragon Ball Superman. So we're going to get into this right now. Make sure I want to like, subscribe, and let's get into this bad boy. Yeah. Nah, this was, this was a crazy one, bro. I ain't going to lie to you, man. Now, Super's the time where Goku became the undisputed Weave Nation president. Like, right. once he got that UI, he was really untouchable. Yep. Yep. Now, I'm not gonna lie to you. I really wasn't in tune with Super until that oh, tournament shit. of power. That's when I really locked in. I'm talking about camping the website. The second that shit Goku dropped, Black, I was uh, there. Shit had uh, me uh, feeling uh, like a deadbeat bother. I was really, uh, well, actually, no, it was the Universe 6 versus Universe 7. That's what kind of got me into Super because mm. they were introduced different universes. Then the Goku Black arc. That shit was tough because everyone wanted to know if Goku was evil, how would that shit go? That nigga was running everybody's pockets. <laughs> That's a sad thing. It's always the, the bad guy <laughs> But version. he was so cool, bro. The, the bad guy version is always he the one. He was that cool just, as hell, okay. bro. He was smoking everybody's back. I bet he was. And then, obviously, the Tournament of Power, that's when... That was, in my opinion, that's like peak Dragon Ball Super. All these different universes you mm -hmm. never knew about. Just going at it. Oh, that shit was tough. I so. gotta check that out. Oh, for sure, bro. They got like a whole little... Uh, I think like they get right to the action. Like oh, They what? have like a oh. compilation. Well, not even compilation. Just a whole video of just the tournament power from start to end. It's just mm. action. So could I check that out on what? Uh, Funimation or... Um... It's on YouTube. Country? Oh, YouTube. Oh, yeah, it's on YouTube. Yeah, he matters. You know me? Take this man for That shit, bro. It's it's like you'll have a good time, bro. That's a bit. <laughs> who shows up in his son's life after he gets drafted but yeah i really like the tournament of power especially that second half because that's where mm -hmm. shit got crazy now goku is someone that will never take shit serious they done told him the universe will get wiped off the map yeah. if they lose his shit and guess what he's doing he's giving the ops free training wasting Bikes. his energy too all because his ass loves to fight normal goku niggas think i'm fighting to save the day but really, nigga, I just like to fight. And this wasn't some weak-ass <laughs> training lessons either. He got shorty up to Super Saiyan 2. Two yeah. And you know Krillin's bald ass has an issue with Goku doing this shit. And he probably wants to say something about it too. But he can't because Goku did him a huge favor. He made Krillin look good fighting him in front of 18. When we know good and well, he had the ability to violate and one-shot him. <laughs> look at the moves he's getting off. <laughs> this shit would not fly if he's trying. Hey, Goku has to be too. one of the greatest wingmen of all time. He extended bro's marriage by 10 years with this one. Max yep. Contracts. But yeah, these two are tough. Like, look at this. Khalifa pulled out a whole pump fake with the key blast. Ooh, got his ass. And Kale wasn't doing shit until she became Rolisha. That's yeah. when she really started putting in pain. Look at her. She giving Goku that Loki team. This man is getting straight CTE. And you know, since Rolisha is a variation of Broly, <laughs> she got all the methods. Dragging his head against the floor. The yeah. Lariant. She's even walking through Goku's attack. Yeah. And Goku was in blue too? Yeah. No, she a demon. Look at how she just tosses bro aside. <laughs> treated his ass like Woody. <laughs> Jiren had to step in and hit her with the legendary like finish Woody. for shit to stop. Because she was attacking everyone, even her own teammate. I'm like, what is he say fuck me for? <laughs> This man Jaren really thought he was I him like after this too. shit, bro. Like he gonna that. get to you later. But yeah, yeah, later on they went on to jump Goku. And they were looking clean. Like, this is some elite levels of coordinated jumping. Now, yeah, not yeah, on the yeah. levels of 17 and 18, because we know how they was running shit back in the future. Mm -hmm. Cooked the Z Fighters and had a 500-0 record against all of them. But these yeah. two, they had some clean plays. Like, look at this. Kel goes up to Goku, hits him with the fuck wrong with you. Jumps up and goes behind him to kick him into the attack. Yeah, damn. Now, I'm gonna keep it a buck, though. That shit did absolutely nothing. But don't worry though, they did way more than that. Like they was really out here using real tactics. They got Shorty over here throwing key blasts at the ground and they just smoke. Damn. And I don't know what happened over here because this man Goku closes his eyes talking about, ooh, I knew you were about to do that. 
and still gets his ass caught. And he gotta be one of the first people I've seen take an L in these situations. Like, y'all know that cliche where the character gets blinded, yeah. or fights with their eyes closed, and they're still just cooking up for whatever reason? I thought that shit would happen here. Thought it had an 100% success rate until now. But nah, we got Goku over here getting caught and is catching these hands. Yeah. But what really pushed him over the edge is when he hit the instant transmission and Shorty predicted it. And he's like, nah, fuck that. Nobody does that shit. Dyes his hair red yeah. like Cardi and started saucing up. This man becomes Dog. jump resistant. Look at this. He yeah, kicks Kalifa away. Cole's ISO on Kale. And Kalifa went out sad because she tried sneaking him not once, but twice. And got cooked both times. But you know what they say, third time's the charm. She trips him like this shit is Tom and Jerry, and Kale hits her with the blast. And Khalifa started celebrating, talking about some, hey, we got him. <laughs> no, because no. Goku's sitting in the beam talking about some, and that shit had her speechless. He comes out the beam and kicks the hope out of him. And at this point, they really had nothing else to try. They went from making all these elite complex plays to saying, all right, bro, we shooting a key blast at him from both sides. Mm -hmm. I know Champ is watching the drop in effort like, there is no passion, there is no vision, there is no aggression, there is no fucking mindset in this football club. Goku deletes both of their yep. weak ass blasts simultaneously That's wild. and sends a key blast to each of them in return. And here we see two types of people. One who stayed and blocked the key blast head on and Kalifa who tried to dip out of there. <laughs> But Goku's key blast was something different though. That yeah. shit came equipped with that chase down hollow thing and it followed her to Boomer. Damn. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. They really didn't stand a chance. Mm -mm. And the crazy part is Goku's doing this shit with low stamina. Yep. This shit blinking red right now. <laughs> and he's still getting the job done. So Kale's holding her in her arms and Goku's just like, aw, that shit cute. Y'all could do that shit in the stands. <laughs> Sends the beam right at him, but it was too late dog. because in that short he amount of said, time, wait, that shit cute. I could do that, that shit, shit in the stands. <laughs> hey, bro, every universe for itself, you lose, oh, you get deleted. Bro. We ain't got time for all that. Hey, man, I'm sorry. Well, shit. Said, that shit cute, but comment, comment. <laughs> hey, Y'all can watch from the stands, man. Y'all can do that shit in the stands. Dance. Oh my god, that shit was funny. That like, was pack him up, bro. Goku. Get him out Crazy of here. Part is, Goku's doing this shit with low stamina. Uh, His shit blinking red right uh, now. And he's still getting the job done. So mm -hmm. Kale's holding her in her arms. And Goku's just like, aw, that shit cute. Y'all could do that shit in the stands. <laughs> Sends a beam right at him, but it was too late. Because yep. in that short amount of time, they already put on the earring Pitara and became range. Catherine. And yeah. uh, we gotta talk about this because she really moved her ass to a new platform to have her back turn to Goku. And bro, how the fuck does she have sunlight on her? <laughs> With no sun. <laughs> I know you see the sky and see that was They got a, that uh, future timeline beam. feel. That all hope is lost. That we not seen tomorrow type feel because his hey. ass is not saving us. But no, yeah, Beerus no. is clearly mad because this shit is technically cheating. But I'm not gonna lie. They basically <laughs> bitched him and told him to shut up because the Xenos are entertained. And once they're entertained, they let shit like this slide Fly, just yeah. like NBA refs. So now that it's confirmed yep. that they can fight like this, just it's like time NBA to refs. get to it. Goku versus Kefla. Man, that red ear must have went out of style because this man started catching Cash. all Ooh. types of L. It starts off with Goku getting hit in the spine and then he proceeds to get hit with the Stop clean out. right hook. After yeah. that, Kefla gut checks him. And I know in Goku's head, he's just like, I ain't gonna lie, I'm getting cut. Kefla tries to one shot him, but Goku blocks that shit. It was way too slow. But these next moves coming up will show you why Kefla is a fiend. So she got bro guarding high from that last attack, leaving the rest of his body wide open. So you would think she would attack the body because that shit's an easy layup why not the only answer is her teacher must be thanos because she was aiming for nothing but the head look at her going all the way up to hit him where he's guarding just so he could get knee in the jaw at the end he gets him flying back and kepler's just rubbing her hands and like there's no way out of this <laughs> done. comes up to him grabs both his legs yep. and starts spinning him around I could hardly watch. Look at how they got my guy looking. <laughs> that is not Goku. This? He gets tossed into a rock so pillar and is just laying there rethinking his decisions. And yeah, bro, he had one option and it was to go Throw the blue. blue. Yep. The way bro came out the smoke, you would think he starts saucing up. But that fight nah. lasted like one minute. Homie only landed one attack and got yeah, one shot straight Kyle at him. Because after Kefla gets sent flying, she came back throwing key blasts. But don't worry though, because he ain't go out from that. He shoots a beam at it to destroy it, which is good. If that shit wasn't a distraction. 
he sneaks up behind him and kicks him straight in the neck, sending him flying and getting dribbled off the ground, falling face first and having the blue knocked out of him. That boy Beerus was up there ready to cry after seeing this shit. He thought his best fighter was taken out and Vegeta was not saving him. We yeah. know it's all good though because there's still one form we haven't seen in this fight yet. Mm -hmm. Goku starts by standing back up, talking about this shit not over. <laughs> Kefla just like, man, stop chatting. This shit over with. Throws yeah. the attack and here it is. Yeah. Goku became Wave Nation <laughs> certified. As a matter of fact, he shot up the ranks <laughs> instantly. He yeah. became the whole president of this shit. And homie came out the transformation talking straight shit. Yeah. Telling her he gonna drop her off. And Frieza in the back is just being racist as hell. <laughs> talking about be your best ape. Like, bruh, that's just Frieza at this point. It don't matter. Bro can't survive in the group chat after what Trunks did to him anyways. <laughs> Kefla <laughs> tries hitting him That's with this funny. fake ass team over Sengon and Goku just slides out the way like yep. <laughs> Had Shorty lost, got her leaning Not at the, the edge of the ledge like she a Smash Bros character. <laughs> the embarrassment wasn't over though. Like nope. I know you see this. Goku got his back turned and y'all know what happens if she yeah. tries attacking that. It they won't work. <laughs> Kefla had to learn though. Yep. She tried attacking him and Goku dodges the we? kick clean as hell. Not like look looking, at him, bro. that stance makes him look like he could be in the Ginyu Force. Kefla funny though, she tried to backflip that miss off like we ain't see that happen. <laughs> that shit was unnecessary though because she just gets embarrassed again. <laughs> Goku is dodging so many attacks I can't even put sound effects in this hoe. Look at him, he dodged 500 <laughs> attacks in the span of 30 <laughs> seconds. He hits the Ali shuffle, gets a couple more dodges in, and she knew she had to change up the method. So she started using Key Blast. But once I saw Goku hitting that Bruce Lee pose, I knew it was raps. She throws Key Blast at him, and look at this. Still not touching me. And he ends this shit off with a flip too. Yeah, this shit is just too easy. He jumps off, and Kefla's just chasing him down. Goku plants his foot into the rock to lean back and dodge the attack. That shit had beers on the sidelines like Andre Drummond. He was hype as what is you on, bro? I told you, bro. You got to go watch that. Duh, I'm going to have to watch that this, shit bro. That was cold, bro. That bro, nigga... my man put his feet in the <laughs> rock. That and... shit was cold, bro. I was like, that was oh, tough, man. oh, yeah. This is how you get your get back, Goku. Get your get back, That, that was tough. I ain't going to even hold you. That shit was Flip wild. Flip too. Yeah, this shit is just too easy for him. He jumps off and Kefla's just chasing him down. Goku plants his foot into the rock to lean back and dodge the attack. Bro. That shit had Beerus on the sidelines like Andre Drummond. He was hype as hell. Goku is just hanging upside down and Kefla's yep. looking at bro, knowing she's cooked. Goku launches her ass through two rock pillars and just looks at his hands like, damn, I'm really like that. <laughs> but here we go with the cap. Kefla comes out the rubble laughing, talking about, yeah. damn, that shit weak as hell. Mm -hmm. So Goku is like, oh, where? Goes right up to her, makes her eat 50 duck punches and kicks her down. Damn. Now I'm just watching like, yeah, that's tough for you, Kefla. Because he really spun the block to make sure it hurt. But it wasn't over, though, because he goes down to her, asking if that shit was still weak. That shit gets her mad and she goes in for an attack, which is something you can't do against you like Goku. He weaves it and punts her across, making her go with mad rocks. But Goku is kind of petty because he said that shit is not enough distance. Huh. Starts airbending and pushes her even further back. And here come the cleanest move. Goku Facts. has ever pulled out Facts. his bag. Kefla started throwing out attacks like she a final boss with 18 bars of health, mm -hmm. but Goku was in this bitch. Look at him, he's jumping from platform to platform. He's doing the perfect run. Kefla makes him jump up with nowhere left to land, and she swore she was about to win. Mm -hmm. Talking about, ooh, got his ass. She launches the attack and Goku gets the surf. Like, look at this, bro. I ain't never seen a move like this. That shit was just elegant. Get off that nigga dick, bro. What is you doing? All right, that was wild. But anyways, he goes right up to her huh? and Kefla surfing. gets hit with the boot. Right there, right in front of that her. That shit was embarrassing. The cameraman had to get all three in. And I know getting hit with this gotta be the worst feeling ever. Gotta be the equivalent to getting dunked on for a game winner in the playoffs. That shit is sticking with you forever. But yeah, man, it's the end of the video. Not this, Thank you for 274K. We uh, move. He surfed, he, bro. He was charging yeah, up the Kamehameha, dodging everything. She hit the last platform, like, I got him now. She hits the blast. He surfs it right up. And then get it point blank. Point blank, bro. When I, I, I watched that multiple times because I lost my. I was like, oh, <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, oh, oh.
That shit looked tough, fam. Mike nah, gonna hold you. That shit was cool as fuck, bro. That Goku nigga, wanna be in his bag, bro. Nah, that nigga said, bro. Oh, that shit was strong enough. We. Bah, 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 bah. <laughs> I thought it was strong enough. You sure? You sure it still was? I ain't never seen a nigga surf someone's attack and hit them from point blank range. There was nothing she could do. She's she, in mid attack like, wait, what? That's because she was still talking shit about it not being strong enough. Oh my God. That was great, bro. You got to shut up sometime, man. That was fantastic, bro. Let it go. Hey, man, if y'all enjoyed that, man, y'all already uh, know. Make sure you <laughs> like, subscribe. I'm definitely going to watch this episode. Yeah, bro. I'm gonna go yeah. catch up on them. Yeah, yeah bro. bro. It's it's, it's enjoyable. You you'll have a great time, man. No, for sure. But hey, continue to spread hey. love, be love, run up them like, share the videos, road to a million. Y'all know what time it is. Catch y'all on the next. One. Peace out. Already. If you got a problem, then we got the solutions. And there's no illusion. I made this shit happen. I'm living life lucid. I'm switching my strategies. Now they hate on me because I'm causing casualties. But why are they after me? Deep inside they know they can't handle half of me